Rescuing animals is hard and sometimes heartbreaking work, but the Greater Victoria woman you're about to meet has dedicated her life to it. Pamela Sadler has been volunteering her time to save animals for more than a quarter of a century. Tess Van Stratton has the details in this week's Vital People. You guys hungry? Hi, babies. Do you want some? Come on. Pamela Sadler is passionate about saving animals. I honestly just feel like it's kind of my purpose. I don't, I feel like that's why I'm here. I've always grown up loving animals. I was always saving things, bringing them home. This is Fritter, that's Apple. This is Willie and Mary Jane. At any given time, the founder of Broken Promises Rescue is looking after between 15 and 25 cats and kittens in her home. It's a bit crazy. We're constantly <laughs> just kittens under feet kittens on the counter trying to get in the fridge but it's amazing it's super fun but um, they're definitely a lot of work we get them some yummy food Pamela's been doing rescue work for 26 years and started Broken Promises almost 12 years ago it's absolutely so rewarding I mean definitely rescue is not easy there's a lot of sadness but thankfully most of it is good and when I can look back at all of the animals that I've helped it definitely warms my heart and it makes me feel like um, I did make a bit of a difference. Pamela's made more than a bit of a difference. Devoting all of her time to animal rescue, she's helped save around 6,000 animals. Pamela's amazing. She's accomplished so much, like just thinking of all the animals she has had um, in her care or to the f different foster homes. Broken Promises is volunteer run and relies entirely on donations, something that's been a big challenge during COVID. We've just been doing a lot of auctions, 50-50 um, draws, just things virtually so we can keep bringing in the money. And also uh, we have a marketplace page, so we're selling gently used items. Um, so it's working. We're, we're managing to keep afloat, but it's definitely a lot harder. Big purr. Vet costs alone are about $130,000 a year, but Pamela's dedicated to saving as many animals as she can. I try and keep my house open to the ones that aren't really adoptable that nobody else wants. So if it's adoptable and so I can find a home for it, I have to let it go. It's so rewarding. It's just, it makes me feel so good to know that we've helped so many. And Pamela plans yeah. to keep helping as long as she can. If I didn't do this work, I think I wouldn't have a purpose. It just gives me something to look forward to every day. Um, I know about an a animal that needs help. It just, there's something in my heart that just makes me know I have to try and help them as much as I can. My pretty girl. Yes, you're a pretty girl. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.